Okay, in this tutorial I'm going to show how to use Crafty Syntax Life Help in order to talk to multiple visitors to your website at the same time. So first we're going to log in. And once in the admin, we're going to navigate to the Live Help tab. In the Live Help tab, we will see the chat requests coming in, the current chats, and the current visitors to the website. For this tutorial, I have in the background three different browser windows, Internet Explorer, Chrome, and Firefox, so that I can uh, make three different chat requests from three different clients. So first I'm going to open up Internet Explorer and I have the chat request from Internet Explorer and I'm going to initiate a chat. I so in the admin I have a request to chat with Explorer and I'm going to activate that and now I have begun the chat with Internet Explorer. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing again with Chrome. Here's another browser, Chrome, Google's Chrome, and I'm going to start another chat request doing the same thing. So now I have activated two separate chats. Now each chat that comes in has a channel color, which is this background color. The Explorer has a yellow and the Chrome has a blue. And that's an easy way to distinguish the different chats, but at the same time be able to see all of the chats at the same on the same window. I'm going to do this again with uh, Firefox and initiate an, a third chat. Three. So now I have three different chats with three different colors. Uh, all chatting at the same time on the same screen. To just demonstrate this a little, here is the Internet Explorer's client side, and I'm going to say, and I can talk to this one customer by clicking on their tab and say, So now, as I'm chatting, I can distinguish the different chats using the color system on the thing. If I would like to just see one chat only, I can use uh, two different options in Crafty Syntax. The first is using this arrow to this eye icon here. What you, happens when you click on that is it will show just that chat, and it will clear out all the rest of the chats which when I do that, now I just see just my chatting to explore. As new messages come in from the other chats that you have, they will show at the bottom of the screen. So if I go over here into the Chrome window and say, uh, uh, something it will show up at the bottom but it will be in their color so I have uh, I know that that message came from this customer and not from the other ones another option to separate out the chats is to to separate these tabs into their own windows which you can do using this icon here this little arrow to a star when it's clicked it will break that chat out of the dock 
uh, here and it will put it in its own window so I can now have a chat uh, in its own window and I can also take these other ones and break them also into their own windows so I just clicked on the arrow for Chrome and I clicked on the arrow for the Explorer chat and now on my uh, computer I have a uh, chat window for the Chrome and a chat window for Explorer and I can have them side by side and chat with them side by side and have crappy syntax still in the background uh, going away but um, but chatting away with these different ones on their own windows if I want to pull these back into the uh, main chat I can do that as well by clicking on the arrow back so this will uh, put everything into one one page again so that's pretty much the basics of the chat system and how to talk to multiple people at the same time uh, one other thing to go over is is the changing of the colors if you have some chats coming in and you uh, want to change the color to better distinguish it or to just change the background color you can do that using this paintbrush icon and that will show the background color of that channel the supports text color and the clients text color and by changing it you can change it on your window so that's pretty much the basics um, I hope that is informative and I hope that uh, uh, that makes sense I'll be uploading more videos as time goes on